this is Karen and you're watching FAQ Friday where I answer all of your fragrance related dilemmas. Now today's question is not fragrance related and it's not a question from a specific person but it's something that I get emailed about time and time again so I thought it would be perfect to address it in an FAQ Friday session. So it's on the subject of emulsifiers and making creams and lotions. I get so many people who email me with um, a dilemma, which emulsifier should I choose? I'm making a lotion, I'm making a cream, I've, you know, I've tried something and my cream has just gone runny, it hasn't thickened, um, or my cream's too thick, what should I do? Well, firstly, one of the things that you need to think about is the emulsifier that you're using. Now the easiest emulsifier to use as a beginner in a cream or a lotion is emulsifying wax. Now emulsifying wax unfortunately is a bit of a catch-all term for lots of different formulations and they don't always declare what is in the formula on the ingredients listing. In the UK and in Europe legally you have to but in other parts of the world you don't. So sometimes you don't really know what it is that's in the emulsifying wax that you're using. Now the important thing about this is that some emulsifying waxes have a built-in thickener and some of them don't. So if you happen to purchase a, an emulsifying wax that doesn't have a built-in thickener and you try and use it to make a cream or a lotion, what you're going to end up with is something that resembles a pint of milk. It's gonna, the emulsifier will lock the oil and the water together, but it won't thicken. So you would need to add, there are a couple of ingredients that you can add, either cetyl alcohol or ceteryl alcohol, which act as help emulsifiers, but they also act as thickeners too. So if you are finding that the emulsifying wax that you're using doesn't thicken your product, then think about including either some cetyl or ceteryl alcohol into your cream or lotion to thicken it up. The more you add, the thicker your product will be. If on the other hand you try your emulsifying wax on its own and it makes a, you know, a lotion but a thickish lo lotion, then you, know, you, can, you can just stick with that on its own. If you wanted to then turn that lotion into a cream, rework your recipe, adding some cetyl or ceteryl alcohol to it and it will just make a thicker cream. So either way, you either need to use something with a an emulsifying wax with a built-in thickener or you need to add some cetyl or ceteryl alcohol to your product. If you enjoyed this video don't forget to like, share and comment below. If you'd like to send me a question to FAQ Friday just drop me an email to faq at karengilbert.co.uk and don't forget to sign up to the mailing list at www.karengilbert.co.uk to get these videos directly into your inbox each Friday. Thanks for watching.